Humana, one of the U.S.'s largest health care providers, is also proactively reinventing their approach to health care. Is it working? Louisville, home to the Kentucky Derby and the nation's fourth largest health insurer, Humana, where every day is race day. Pedometer wearing employees track their steps online and rack up rewards for healthy behavior in the Virgin Health Miles program. That must motivates consumers. We're all for it. At Humana's Innovation Center, they see these types of programs as one answer to a critical question about health care in the U.S. But how do you engage with consumers to change how they actually live their lives? Because, you know, if they're getting more unhealthy, the costs are going to go up. So Humana's Vice President of Consumer Experience, Grant Harrison, encourages workers to seek answers in popular activities like video games. And what people find as they're doing this is, you know, they're not even really noticing that they're actually pedaling faster and faster. Oh, yeah. Um, so they're pedaling, they're getting aerobic activity, there's it's balance. That keep the sides. Yeah, that's because your steering is very bad. <laughs> Humana tests technology that might show its 11 million members what they'd look like if they gained or lost weight, and pedals its freewheeling bike sharing program to employees as a way to get around town, all in hopes of a payoff down the road. How long does it take you to realize the benefits of it? It, it takes uh, us quite a long time to realize the benefits. Okay. Some of the stuff we're doing um, on the basis that we, we believe, it's okay. almost it's a right brain thing, we believe this is going to give us a payback and it's going to help our consumers. Humana's Vice President of Product Innovation, Beth Bierbauer, seeks inspiration in all kinds of places. We've actually taken a few pages from the financial services industry. Some of those pages now come in the form of monthly or quarterly smart statements that track what clients spend and what they spend it on. And Humana's cut paperwork with a debit card linked right to a client's health savings account so deductibles and drugs can be paid for with the swipe of a card. Now the question is, will these steps give Humana a lead in the long race to rein in rising health care costs? For the Business of Innovation, I'm Mary Thompson. It's all about keeping the customer engaged. Dr. Jonathan Jack Lord is Senior Vice President and Chief Innovation Officer at Humana, one of the largest health benefits companies in the United States, with 11 and a half million members. His job, pushing the company faster and smarter in designing innovative health plan products to meet the needs of a world facing a health crisis. And Dr. Jack Lord joining us now. Jack, thank you so much for joining us. Good to have you on the program. Thank you, Maria. So how are you innovating? What we've really tried to do is bring retail type experiences to the healthcare system. Things like personalization, segmentation, honoring and respecting individuals and individual needs and judgments, as opposed to a system that was really pretty much dominated by experts, where the individual was subject to direction and not an active participant. How do you handle this huge challenge of cost containment at a time when more innovation might simply deliver marginal benefits of, of questionable economic value and but add enormously to the cost. Well, the, the combination of approaches are to deal with the uh, emerging technologies and understand their value and impact but probably more importantly there are a lot of very low technology types of interventions and ways to engage consumers to be healthier. We've got an opportunity to engage people in ways to live healthier and we need to make a paradigm shift from what has been a sick care system where we throw in a lot of very high tech and expensive services in to a real health system that encourages health along the way. How is the health delivery system going to adapt in fundamentally different ways around people, the patient, rather than around we need to have the cardiologist sitting here and the oncologist sitting here. How is that going to change? We're, we're experimenting and we're looking for ways to create a, a class of master patients who can help other patients cope with their disease and understand the disease. And the takeaway, high-speed innovation means being a nimble company, using research and science best, developing better products, knowing your customer which is who we know is the patient. Dr. Vassella, good to have you on the program. Thank you Dr. very much. Dr. Lord, thank you so much for joining us. We appreciate it. Thank you.